presented by Clemson Libraries. You have to do some research for an assignment. What's your first step? Google? This is not a bad place to start, especially for background information and brainstorming ideas, so why not use it all the time? Well, the Internet is a lot like the ocean. It's enormous and has all sorts of things in it. Searching Google is like trying to find something in the whole ocean. If you need something specific, that could take a very long time. Most scholarly articles, those sources your professors want you to use because they're written by experts, are not available on Google. Many high-quality information sources are hidden in the deep web, where you need special access just to search. If you do find what you need, you might be asked to pay to get to it. Whoa, don't do that. So if you can't get the stuff you need from Google, what do you use? Library resources. Our databases give you special access to the deep web and have organized this vast sea of information into buckets. They are big buckets with lots of topics like academic search complete and web of science, and smaller buckets such as global plants, American song, daily life, iconda, with only special types of information. Remember, these buckets have different stuff in them, so search in several different databases to make sure you get the best, most relevant sources for your research. Where can you find these amazing buckets of information? Start your search at the Clemson Library's website, libraries.clemson.edu. Oh, and don't forget you can ask a librarian to help you. We're kind of like your own personal ocean guides. Ahoy!